Hi friends, welcome once again in another episode of Derivative. Uh, well, in previous video, we learned a lot about the algebraic uh, rules of the derivative, right? And here we are oh, going to expand some product rules, right? Uh, some some problems of the product rules we are going to do here that uh, you will make some more concept in product rule, right? So, uh, what we have learned in uh, algebra of derivative that uh, the derivative of the product of two functions is uh, like this, right? Derivative of the right derivative of the product of the two functions that is uh, one function is suppose f x, right? And another function is g, so g x. So derivative of the two function is equals to uh, first function times the derivative of the second function, right? That's gx. Again, second function times the derivative of the first function, that is f of x, right? Or you can simply write like this also, uh, fx uh, dot, oh it's, uh, well, times gx prime right f prime this I mean, uh, this prime means the actually the derivative so fx times g prime x uh, means the first function times the uh, derivative of the second function again second function times the derivative of the first function that is f prime x right or in the u of v form you can also write like this uh, u and v uh, sorry it's not the plus it's the multiplication that's product right product of the two functions it's u and v right what is u here as we have learned there fx is uh, uh, now considered as here u and gx is considered here v so u and v right uh, so what will be uh, derivative of the uh, u and v that we are going to find out so d by dx of u v will be equals to first u times derivative of the v again v times derivative of the u right or simply what you can write uh, you you can write u times v prime is equals to u dot v prime and v dot u prime that's a uh, product of these two two functions right uh, derivative of the product of the u and v is equals to uh, u times the derivative of the v and the v times the derivative of u so please uh, sorry uh, please 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 keep this formula in your mind and uh, let's uh, start some problem uh, related to this product product rule right so let me let me suppose some 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 function uh, suppose let fx is equals to x uh, uh, x sine theta okay sine uh, sine sin x or sine theta whatever sine x let, let, let me suppose this now i'm going to find the derivative of this right so the derivative of the uh, derivative of the derivative of the x times sine x right x times sine x is equals to now x time that is first term uh, or first function times the derivative of the second function again second function right times the derivative of the first function that is dx by dx right so what I will get here x time derivative of the sine x and derivative of the sine x I know you are remembering that is cos x and plus sine x sine x times dx uh, that is dx by dx that's equals to 1 right so uh, we got the derivative power that is d by dx of x times sine x x times sine x is equals to this and this one is not necessary to write so uh, so I'm not writing this one simply that's it right so this is our uh, derivative so like this you can uh, use the uh, product of the uh, product of the uh, product root of the derivative and it makes us uh, s solving the problems or finding the derivative quite easy right so uh, let me suppose another example uh, let me take suppose fx equals to uh, suppose uh, mm, okay uh, I'm thinking a lot x cos x right times uh, x minus 10 x okay x minus x right so now we have to use this uh, we have to find out the derivative of this so it's uh, it's becoming uh, quite long right and now exactly this will be the perfect use of the derivative uh, set product rule of the derivative so here the derivative of the function will be simply as we have learned the first function times the derivative of the second function right so your first function is here x plus cos x times derivative of the second function that is x minus tan x right and then plus derivative of the second function right so here derivative of the second function will be uh, uh, sorry uh, not derivative of the deri uh, means uh, second function this first function derivative of the second function so the second function x minus 10x 
second function times the derivative of the first function that is d by dx of the second function that is x plus cos x x plus cos x right so uh, here now x plus cos x x plus cos x uh, I'm taking in this bracket right so derivative of the x that will be simply dx by dx again minus d by dx of tan x right and now plus uh, again x minus tan x right and then times again dx by dx oh I forget to take the bracket okay in bracket and again plus uh, d that's cos x right cos x by dx uh, well so now x plus cos x right now all in bracket so uh, derivative of dx by dx is simply the one minus derivative of the tan x I know you are remembering it's sec square x right now plus x minus tan x x minus tan x times dx by dx that's the derivative of x is simply one plus now cos uh, cos x what's the derivative of the cos x that's minus sine x right uh, well we can write simply one minus sine x so this is exactly our answer so right, uh, let me write it properly yeah, it's not looking nice uh, well uh, derivative of the uh, x cos x times uh, x minus tan x right is equals to is equals to right is equals to x plus cos x and 1 minus sec square x whole plus x minus tan x x minus tan x and then 1 minus sin x right so like this we have to use the product rule and we have to find out the uh, the derivative of the uh, uh, derivative of different different functions I hope you understand now the how to use the product rules right and in later videos we'll be doing some more tough problems of the product rules right uh, it's becoming so quite longer so I have to stop it and in next video we'll be waiting okay bye bye